at Cohesion Football, our objective is to build leadership and problem-solving skills for participants. We also have an objective to expand access to opportunities for previously excluded young and at-risk children in Nigeria. We also believe we can build a drug-free and socially responsible network of young leaders. Through Cohesion Football, we will build a network of alumni and mentors who will inspire and guide participants. And lastly, we will change in perception of opportunity by young people in marginalized communities served by the youth leadership, leading to declines in risk tolerance, especially among school leavers. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. We are live at the Union Bank Sports Stable for the third edition of Cohesion Football Tournament. I am the voice and I'm totally yeah, so the tournament aims to, right to um, reach out to kids between the ages of 9 to 15 and um, one of the major aims is to inspire, mentor and educate these kids. We use their passion as a tool to bring them into a Cohesion Football Tournament and at the end of the day, we ensure that we incorporate positive and right values inside them. And that is where the Cohesion Football Tournament we are currently looking at children who have passion for football and we are helping them with their passion to achieve their goal in life. So what we are currently doing, we are facing the children around Moshe Oile and Sule Athens and we are using football as a, as a means to an end to achieve what we are doing, to make them stay in school and keep them away from drugs. That is the essence of cohesion. That is what cohesion stands for. And we all know that football is the number one sport in Nigeria. So we have decided to use football as a tool to reach out to these kids. This is uh, a 14 year old dream. That is uh, bringing life to humanity, to young kids. Over the last three editions, Cohesion Football Tournament has directly impacted about 500 children, with over 2,000 children engaged through the tournament. Let me start again. Okay. I just want to say a big thank you to the organizer of this tournament. The vision is real, the vision is life, affecting the life of children. It's, it's something that giving them hope. It adds one vision I love so much. It's not just about football, but it's about education. Encouraging children to be part of education, not just playing soccer. We want to say a big thank you to him. I would like to thank the organizer, the brain behind coercion, Mr. Dari. I think he's, he has tried a lot. He's done a lot. A huge thank to him. Everybody is happy. He's making the kids happy. He's making the coaches happy. The parent is making them happy. We all love him. I want to say a big thank you for the support they are giving to these kids, to these football teams, and to all the coaches. So it's been, it's been a wonderful man. The last three years, we've been successful to organize this football tournament called Coalition Football Tournament. And we've been able to pick out 20 exceptional kids, 20 exceptional kids from this tournament we've, we've organized for the past three years to form a bigger thing because we thought about continuity that okay after the tournament what can we do to further reach out to these kids and we decided to form the coalition all starting where we uh we got a, a, a professional uh, uh, coach for them we got them to train in a more um, equipped environment uh, thereby exposing these kids and we also follow through uh, in their education because core, part of our objective is to also encourage the children and the kids to also go to school apart from playing, playing football. This is unprecedented. The manner, the packaging, the branding, everything is totally perfect and I Anthony, the voice of 99.3 Nigeria Info, I am right here to catch every glimpse of the action. Stick around. 